Hi, it's Roberto Mickey with your COVID-19 update for Miami-Dade County on November 11th, 2020. Unfortunately, we've had a dramatic increase in the number of admitted patients, and we now have over 500 patients admitted with 505 countywide. Once again, this is a continuing trend of increasing patients that are admitted to the hospital, and it is not a good sign for Miami-Dade County. The number of positive tests was 664, with a percentage of positive tests being 5.74%. The 14-day average is still above 5% with 6.51%. Once again, this Sun Sentinel article outlines that we may need to take these numbers with a grain of salt and the numbers may actually be worse than what we're presenting here in these charts. The number of new admissions was 72 and the number of discharges outpaced admissions 74 to 72 and ventilators are still readily available with 572 countywide. There is no doubt that the increasing number of admitted patients with COVID-19 is a real trend. And we've reached 500 patients admitted to the hospital, which means we've reached about 10% of our hospital capacity. I think this county needs to make a serious decision in the near future about what it's going to do about this increasing number before it's too late. We do not want to get to what we got to in July where we reached 50% capacity. I don't think the healthcare system could take another big hit like it did in July and it really needs to be addressed at the county level and at the state level. This is the MiamiDade.gov website giving information on the data from Miami-Dade County. And this is the Broward County website giving similar data. And this is the Washington Post website with some of the graphs that we used. Everyone out there, stay safe, wear a mask, and if you like this video, hit the like button and hit the subscribe button and help out the channel. Thanks a lot. Thank you.